Are you looking for the best Nikon digital cameras? In this video we will look at some of the best Nikon digital cameras on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Number 1. HP Victus 15. The HP Victus 15 is a phenomenal value for casual gamers. The price is more than reasonable and it's capable of running most games at 30 frames per second. The keyboard features an edge-to-edge -edge design, which really makes maximum use of the laptop's interior. As for feel, key travel is long because of the deep chassis. Longer travel means less accidental keystrokes, which is what you want in a gaming laptop. A quick peek inside reveals an Intel Core i5-12 for 50H CPU, an NVIDIA GTX 1650 GPU, 8GB of RAM, and 512 of SSD storage. That's enough oomph for lightweight gaming. That said, given the specs, the Victus isn't going to hit 60fps in most games. If you can live with this limitation and are strapped for cash, then the HP Victus 15 is a fantastic pick. Number 2. Asus VivaBook Pro 15 Old. For those who would prefer to buy a laptop and have money left over for awesome peripherals, the Asus VivoBook Pro 15 Old is a great option. It comes in at a few hundred dollars cheaper than other picks on this list and it still has good overall performance. It has a Ryzen 7 5800H CPU and a GeForce RTX 3050, which is enough to achieve decent frame rates on your favorite games while accomplishing all of your productivity tasks. But the true highlight of this laptop is the stunning 1080p old display with exceptional color performance and accuracy. It might not be the most exciting laptop to look at, but to get this kind of performance and an old screen to boot makes the Vivo Book Pro 15 a great value. Number 3. Dell G16. The Dell G16 is a good option for both work and play. When it came to processor performance, it smashed the competition to smithereens. The Dell G16 nabbed the top spot in the PC Mark 10 benchmark, which measures performance based on general use tasks like office productivity and video chatting. It also turned in 131 FPS when running the rise of the Tomb Raider benchmark. You can thank the hardware for those numbers. It has an Intel Core i7 12700H CPU, an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060 GPU, 16GB of RAM and 512GB of PCIe NVMe SSD storage. The G16 isn't the sexiest looking laptop we've ever reviewed, but it gets the essentials right and that's what really matters. According to our tester, it's one of the most powerful RTX 3060 based laptops we've tested.